where I peaked in life, for <laughs> sure. Good morning, everyone. Guess who actually took a shower this morning and blow dried her hair and straightened it and put on makeup by the time she was supposed to leave for work? Um, this girl. Let's just say I'm a superhero. All I'm saying. So the reason I was, it was so necessary for me to get my hair done this morning um, is because Jack is in a wedding today. Yes, on a Friday. And so he was gone all, all almost all yesterday because he had the. Why can I not talk? He had the dress rehearsal and all of the before the wedding day stuff yesterday. So he's there today and the wedding is tonight at six o'clock. I don't get off work until seven. So driving up there ASAP after work. So I didn't have any time to get ready. So I'm literally wearing like what I would wear to work to the wedding. I put on some like nicer, slightly more fashionable dress pants sort of and then I'm re-wearing this green sweater. Sue me. I'm an outfit repeater. I know. I own it. I had a dream last night that the emerald in my ring just like slowly started oh, sorry. I get little hairs stuck in it all the time from these little like the little prongs that hold the emeralds up. I get little hairs stuck in there. Um but I literally had a dream that the emerald in my ring was like, shh, what's the word? Flaking, but like in chunks, like chunking off, I guess. And so like, it was literally like I looked down and there was a piece missing and I was like, what the heck? Like, where did that go? And then it was like the next time I looked at it and like half of the thing was missing. And so the other half was just like bouncing around inside of there, like flopping back and forth. And I was so traumatized. Like, not because it's like, oh my god, my ring. Well, first of all, this is a, that means a whole lot. Like, that's a super special thing that I will love and cherish forever. But the only thing I could think of, I was like, Jack is going to be so mad at me. Because he spent all this money to buy this for me. And he picked it out just for me. And it's perfect. And I love it. And I'm going to have to tell him that it's shattered and broke to pieces. It made me so sad. I woke up this morning and texted him. I was like, literally had the most traumatic dream of all time. So sorry. It was awful. But it's all good. It's still intact this morning. Thank goodness. I would have been so sad. <laughs> I'm going to put this away so that I can focus on driving to work because it's a wet kind of rainy day. Um... So yeah, I'll see you guys after work, whenever that may be. So I am now off to this wedding shindig. I'm 43 minutes away and the wedding started at 6 p.m. It is currently mm, probably like 7.03. So let's just say I'm showing up fashionably late, but I'm gonna get there around 7.45, so won't be too deep I guess into the reception so I'll get to enjoy it and say hi to them and celebrate with them for a little bit of time so I'm excited I'm not gonna vlog it all in the car ride one because I really just want to sing musicals <laughs> two um, it's kind of rainy today so the roads are wet and I get really nervous driving on wet roads so I don't want to be trying to do three things at once um, <laughs> driving singing and vlogging <laughs> I'll just stick to driving and singing um, okay but I'm rambling now but I'm gonna go so this vlog well I don't know how much I talked this morning it may be really short I'm not sure but it's also probably gonna be up late so forgive me but I am celebrating the love of some friends so I think we'll all be okay and survive I love you guys and I will see you guys wow it's really super dark um, I'll see you guys later obviously whenever I officially end the vlog so don't fret I will see you all later have lovely lovely times peace out all you girl scouts bye okay so we just got back in Danville from the wedding it's awesome Jack looks so handsome I'm tired <laughs> we busted a move many moves did we ever 
my knees are feeling it. Yeah, we're, I feel we're, like such a grandma. We got into the car and we're like, oh my lower back. Oh my, <laughs> my knee. <laughs> oh my gosh. But that was such a lovely wedding. I was only there for the reception, but Jack said the, the ceremony was beautiful. just beautiful. Shout out to JD and Emma. We and love you. them. Happy married couple. Yes. It was awesome to be a part of their day. Uh, and to just jam out to so many throwback middle school. So many. It was like my prime. It was good. Comment below if your prime was Grills, Fergalicious, name off some more. Uh, Akon. Akon. Um, <laughs> let me think. Uh, what was Snappy it? Fingers. Usher, the Yeah, yeah. album. Yes, Confession. 2000. That's good. That's so good. So any of that, if that just like that was like where I peaked in life for <laughs> sure which is sad uh, <laughs> if that resonates sad. with you then just comment below which which one's your favorite actually from that era because that was like my sweet spot in life there was Fat Joe that came on too and I was the only one that really knew those yeah words. no one else really knew that too much but we, you we got it. jiggy we, we got did it. this girl has some moves this guy has some moves really though he was surprising some people. <laughs> My Fergalicious rap always oh, that was is always a game changer. Yeah. They didn't play lip gloss, which I was a little Ooh, upset about. Should, we should have told Will to play that. I know. I didn't think about it until after that thing, and Damn. then it was like I got water because I thought I was about to pass out. Not yeah, really, it was so it was hot. Very hot. Um, <sighs> but there's nothing like going to a wedding that makes me actually so excited for our wedding. Yes. I can't wait to vlog our whole wedding. <laughs> the whole time I'm going to have like, Hey guys, we're up in front of everybody right now. About to say I do. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait. Yeah, seriously. I'm excited to marry you. Then to bust our own moves. Our own moves. On, on our own dance floor. I can't wait. Well, now we're going to Jack's house and he's going to get out there. <laughs> and I'm going to drive home because he so sweetly drove back with me and his parents took his car back because I don't like driving in the dark and in the rain. So. Yeah, it was crappy weather. Yeah, not good. Um, but, yeah, so that's it. Vlogmas day 21, right? Yes. We're so close. We have... Which means nine months away from our wedding. Oh, oh today. Nine months. Oh. Nice catch. <gasps> Thank you. That was sick. Um, nine months insane and four days until Christmas nine months till our wedding four days till Christmas could there be a merrier time of the year if we we're getting married in two days it was September <laughs> <laughs> then yes <laughs> um, but that's it from us happy vlogmas we will see you all tomorrow and that's it yeah that's all we got for you much love okay so um, I know I ended this in the car with Jack, but one, just wanted to say I can literally not wait to marry him. I'm so excited and I wish it was happening tomorrow. He's just the best ever in the whole world. And I know you guys get to see little bits and pieces of him on the internet, but he's seriously just the greatest person that's ever existed and I am so lucky to get to be the one that gets to experience all of that with him i'm seriously i love him so much and i'm so grateful for him and he just loves me so well mm, i just love him um but also just wanted to let you guys know that it is 12 30 and i'm just now getting in my bed to start editing this so it will be late and it will be choppy and messy and that's just going to have to be okay because I don't have the energy to do anything else. <laughs> but that's it. Just wanted to let you guys know how late I'm doing this so that you don't judge me for the quality of this video. <laughs> that's it. Peace out. Love you guys. See you tomorrow.